Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I'm back today with a very spontaneous video. I'm going to be doing a Lush haul and these used to be my favourite videos to watch. I used to just binge watch Lush hauls and I wasn't planning on doing this at all but yesterday it was my little sister Coco's 11th birthday party and she had a party at Lush which can I just say was amazing. It was so much fun. Um, I would really really recommend it and we had the whole store to ourselves and while the kids were like playing games it gave me a chance to like look around and I was just like oh my god there is so much I need to buy. So I had a little spree and I just really really wanted to show you everything I got because there's such a nice selection of my favourite products here and some that I've never tried before. They also have so many gorgeous limited edition products in for Valentine's Day that are some of my favourite Lush products of all time that only come out this time of year. So I really just wanted to show you guys what I got to give you some inspo. Um, and it's just been such a long time since I did a video like this. So it's super old school, but I'm really excited. Okay, I don't know where to start. There are so many nice things. Okay, I'm going to start with a bubble bar. And this is... This is the best product ever actually and it is the unicorn horn bubble bar oh my goodness gracious honestly you just have to go and smell this for me it's by far the best smelling product in Lush so this is a bubble bar so you crumble this under running water like you would put bubble bath in your bath and it makes your bath such a pretty color and it's also got um like glitter in it not glitter but it's kind of iridescent like pearly I'm literally serious like I just can't stop smelling this and if you're not really a bath person like I'm not really a bath person I have the occasional bath I have a little um open box of Lush products like bath bombs and bubble bars that I put in my wardrobe because then my whole wardrobe smells of it like you know when you walk into Lush and it's like you can smell it that's kind of what happens when you open my wardrobe and then I also like to put them back in the paper and like put them in my pajama drawer my underwear drawer because it has the same effect it makes like it all smell really nice next I have a couple of face masks because face masks are one of my favorite products that Lush do I love all of their skincare the first one is catastrophe cosmetic and I think I've mentioned this in a video before because it's one of my favorite face masks so this one is a blueberry based face mask it's very high in antioxidants and it has like chamomile and rose which are very gentle and calming on the skin so I think this is one that you're supposed to use when you're having like a skin catastrophe um so like breakouts and stuff like that which I don't really get but I can't tell you like how lovely this makes my skin feel when I take this off it's so soft it's like stroking chalk in a nice way i don't know that was weird it's just so enjoyable to apply so you keep these in the fridge because they're fresh face masks so you actually have to use them up pretty quickly and then i also got um cupcake face mask and this one is like a chocolatey one so it uses cocoa butter and cocoa powder but then it also has peppermint and spearmint 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 so it's very refreshing and invigorating and this is another one that's for oily skin it actually says that it's for teenage skin because it helps breakouts and that kind of thing but i like this one because it says it absorbs excess oil so i hope that it prevents breakouts but it smells incredible as well honestly incredible so i need to pop these back in the fridge asap next i have a couple of more skincare products and i have two toners now the first one is the breath of fresh air toning water and this is the one that i used to use every single day it's so so gorgeous i love the way this is described it says the sea breeze captured in a bottle and that's actually exactly what it smells like it actually has fresh sea water in it fresh spring water rose absolute rosemary oil aloe vera all really beautiful ingredients and if you're using it as a toner you can just spray it onto a cotton pad and like um, brush it over your face um, but it's also really lovely just to spray on your face if your skin needs a little pick-me-up or a little refresh and a lot of the ingredients are actually aromatherapy a lot of the ingredients are used for aromatherapy so it's supposed to be quite calming and relaxing but also refreshing for your mind and not just your skin which I think is really really nice and then the other one that I got is the Aroma water and this is pretty much the same it's this kind of aromatherapy spray slash toner but this one uses rose water and lavender water so it's just so so gentle on your skin so this is perfect if you have sensitive skin it's lovely to spray on your face before you apply your makeup to really just hydrate your skin and this is also a great product to take out with you in your handbag like if your skin is feeling a bit dry or your makeup's feeling a bit old and you just need a refresh you can just spray this over your makeup and it gives you a really nice dewy glow and just like refreshes your makeup and your face and again you can just spray this onto a cotton pad as well after you've cleansed 
cleanse just to remove any extra dirt or leftover cleanser off your face um but it's super super gentle i did buy quite a few more things but before i show you i just want to show you this which the people at lush who were so so lovely um by the way they were so amazing with the kids and it was they made it so much fun but they really really kindly popped one of these in my bag as a present and this is one of the limited edition valentine's gift sets and this is the love and kisses gift set and i've never had this one before and it's unopened as you can see so i'm gonna open it now oh my god i don't want to open it it's all wrapped up so beautifully so first of all we have this gorgeous little pink soap that says love oh my gosh um and this is the love you love you lot soap i actually saw this in the store and i was smelling it and i was like oh my god i really like that and this has rose petal infusion rapeseed oil coconut oil rose syrup rose petals rose oil this is like the rosiest soap ever but it doesn't really smell like of like that old lady rose this is really really beautiful i love that oh i love this stuff it's the prince charming shower cream i love this stuff it is just this gorgeous pink pink shower gel. This is so fruity and fresh. So this has marshmallow root and vanilla pod infusion. That's why it smells so sweet. That's amazing. Organic cocoa butter, grapefruit oil, sandalwood oil, geranium oil, fresh pomegranate juice. Super fruity and sweet. It's so, so nice because it's not like sickly sweet because it's very fruity and fresh. There are four products in here. <gasps> oh my gosh. I love Lush massage bars. So this is the Love Spell massage bar. And honestly, the massage bars are so incredible. If you have like horrible pains in your muscles, like I really get them badly in my shoulders. Um, this is so nice just to rub in and you can really like push against your muscles and like the little ridges in the bar kind of like go into your muscles. I can't explain it, but they melt at the temperature of your skin and your skin just absorbs all of the like oils in the bar. And it just feels so amazing. It's so soothing and also it has to be said that these are the best moisturizers for your body honestly they are so much better than using like a body cream because your skin just absorbs the oil and it honestly leaves you feeling so soft and smooth and gorgeous like you just want to keep touching your body it's lovely and then the final product in the box oh my god I was literally gonna buy this and I didn't because I'd bought so much. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Okay, so it is the Kiss Lip Scrub. This is my favorite lip scrub and it only comes out around Valentine's Day. I have quite dry lips, so I love to just scrub them in the morning, put some lip balm on and that's like your lips prepped for the day, like for lipstick. So you just take a little bit of this on your finger, scrub your lips and then you can lick it off because it's edible. It's literally like sugar and salt. This makes my lips plumper. Like when I scrub them, they literally look like like big, red, juicy, pouty lips. I swear this makes my lips bigger. Now I'll show you the last few things that I bought myself. So I got this hand cream and this is the Helping Hands hand cream. And I actually bought this for my boyfriend because his hands get so dry in the winter it's like really horrible the cold weather just makes his hands literally like so dry and i feel so sorry for him because it's horrible so i got him this hand cream that i will probably use as well i'm just gonna put this on now he won't mind probably won't even use it let's be honest boys are just rubbish with remembering to do stuff like this so this is the hand cream and it says it's a nurturing almond cocoa butter and chamomile hand cream to give back some of what life and washing has taken out and then the last couple of things i got this massage bar i actually got this for my mum um, and she's used it a tiny bit but I asked her to give it back to me to show you and this is the hottie massage bar it has these um like bobbles and these are really good to work into the muscles and then I bought a massage bar for myself and this is my favorite massage bar that I have loved for years and this is the wiki magic muscles massage bar it's kind of like a fresh spicy smell it's very unusual um, and the oil in this just makes my skin feel incredible and the best thing about this is it has the aduki beans at the top and these again are amazing for working into your muscles because they're very hard so you can just push this into like your shoulder and just massage it in oh my god honestly it's heaven so that's everything that i bought but then i also have this little um bubble bar Basically, when you do a Lush party, you actually make one of the products and Coco decided that she wanted to make the comforter bubble bar. This is what it's supposed to look like. Here's what mine looks like. 
In fairness to me, I used whatever what was left over after all the kids had made one and it was supposed to be a donut and it was actually really good when I made it but it's got squished in the bag so even though this looks like unicorn poo it will still make a really nice bubble bath. So that's everything I got from Lush. That was so much fun. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next Monday. Bye!